and some uh, political updates coming in from the pole bound state of Goa where two more BJP MLAs have resigned after being denied tickets. MLA uh, Isidore Fernandez and PWD Minister Deepak uh, Poskar have resigned ahead of Goa polls. Both BJP leaders were denied tickets and now they have uh, quit. In fact, uh, these two uh, netas include MLA Isidore Fernandez and PWD Minister Deepak Poskar. And BJP's worries related to Goa polls uh, do not end there. There is a massive rebellion which is actually brewing uh, uh, within the party unit ahead of uh, state polls. And BJP's candidature list has miffed uh, several of their leaders. And it has uh, also miffed uh, Utpal Parikar. Uh, we have spoken at length about him, how he was uh, completely uh, not at all happy after he was denied ticket from Panji. And now we are seeing former Goa CM Lakshmi Kant uh, Parsekar has rebelled against the party for not getting a ticket from Mandram constituency. In fact, sources say that he might quit as Goa manifesto in charge now uh, as a sign of protest. In fact, his supporters want him to quit the BJP altogether and fight the elections independently. Meanwhile, Parsekar has called for a meeting with his supporters today uh, to discuss the next step and what exactly to do and explore his options. So this is what we are getting right now. Uh, as far as uh, BJP is concerned before Goa polls and let me go across to uh, Ketan uh, who is joining us live from the newsroom to give uh, more perspective on this big story that we are tracking on Mirror now. So uh, Ketan, yesterday we saw how Utpal Parikar, uh, uh, Utpal, Utpal Parikar's uh, exclusion actually gave birth to a massive controversy. Uh, there were uh, statements made uh, by the BJP where they said that they are going to placate uh, the uh, MIF leader, they are going to give him options. Now we are seeing another big face uh, registering protest and even calling for a meeting to explore his options. What exactly is happening with the BJP unit there? For BJP don't seem to be ending as many sitting MLAs and um, ministers are, are quitting. Uh, so Lakshmikan Parsekar has not yet officially uh, announced uh, that he is quitting. However, he is, he is visibly very ap upset at being given the Mandrem uh, constituency ticket to uh, to Dayanand Sopte. Dayanand Sopte had left Congress and joined the BJP and uh, BJP has given ticket to him instead of uh, the former Chief Minister uh, Lakshmikan Parsekar. So what we are uh, getting to hear is that he is going to meet his uh, followers today and, and make a decision on that front. In the interim, Two more BJP MLAs have quit and most likely they are going to uh, fight the election independently. Isidore Fernandez, who was the deputy speaker in, in this assembly, mm, he has quit as, uh, as MLA. And we are also uh, getting to hear that the PWD minister Deepak Pauskar has also uh, resigned uh, as as the MLA and he is also expected to either join some other party or or fight it independently. As far as uh, Utpal Parrikar goes, he has given, uh, he's speak, speaking to ANI, he has said in one line that he's going to take a press conference to clear his stand. Utpal Parrikar is not reachable. We also tried to reach him. Uh, and uh, the last bit is when Devendra Fadnavis said that they are not giving him Panji seat. They had offered him two more seats out of which he said no to one and uh, about another seat, the name of which is not known to us so far. Uh, negotiations are going on with uh, the BJP central leadership and Utpal Parikar. So if uh, that negotiations fail, then clearly one can see that uh, tr troubles mounting for BJP in the uh, in in the coastal state. Right, Ketan. Thank you so much for getting us all those details. Uh, in in fact, we will be tracking all the updates and all the happenings that are taking place uh, in the pole-bound state of Goa.